So, I'm here. Uh, I have a new video. So, um, one of my favorite wrestlers um, in the WWE right now is Antonio Cesaro. Now, you know, he's he's destined to be the next breakout star. I mean, he has that great swing. He's just so over with the fans. Everyone, you know, he'll be breaking up from the Real Americans and doing all this great stuff. But, I mean, is... Is he is is eventually going to be the key word here? Is Antonio Cesar really going to become that guy? Is he really going to be a champion? Is he really going to be someone who's recognized in the face of the company? Because I mean, this has happened before. All all these NXT guys, who everyone's like, oh, they're going to be the guy, and then just like it doesn't happen. I mean, it's it's happened. It's been predicted many times that someone's going to end up being the big guy of the company, and then it just doesn't happen. You know, they screw it up or something. There have been plenty of guys. I, I can think of the Ultimate Warrior. He was meant to be the guy, I mean, beating Hogan at WrestleMania, and then he screwed it up, and now he never, you know, he never became that guy. He never became a leader in the company. I mean, okay, I believe that Roman Reigns will be the next John Cena, but I I feel like I've never really seen that guy who's meant to be the next breakout star become the breakout star. I feel like the guy that's the next breakout star is really the one that from the beginning was a breakout star, not the one that like slowly became breakout and getting all over. Because I feel like that that just, something about it, I start to feel like that's not really what's going to end up happening. Um, yeah, so... Wondering everyone's thoughts. Anyways, click the like button. Subscribe, please. Alright, thanks guys. See you later.